The heart of the daily routine app is this screen. It shows today's time slots, plus two days in the past and four days in the future, making a week altogether. This is the activities list. Routines are built using the items in this list. By default, the app has these eight activities, but we can edit them or add our own at any time. This is the list of our routines. The app starts with one example routine. We could delete it or add a second routine, but for now we'll edit this routine by tapping it. Routines have many editable properties such as name and icon, but the most important is time slots. The time slots list has two parts, a scrollable list of time slots on the right and the relative duration of these time slots on the left. To edit a time slot, tap it. To change the start time, end time or duration of a time slot, tap the time slot button. These two wheels represent the time slots start and end times respectively. Together they control the time slots duration. To print or email a routine to a friend, tap the email or print button. Here we can customize a PDF of our routine, then print or email it. We can also view it in another app. Daily Routine decides what to show in the main view based on how we've set up our routines and our routine calendar. By default, the example routine is scheduled for every day. To change a routine schedule, tap it in the top list, then tap the dates button. We can change the scheduled days and the scheduled weeks. Alternatively, we can specify a specific date range. Of course, all these routines are only useful if we follow them. If we enable notifications, daily routine will notify us whenever a new time slot starts. The more page contains all the miscellaneous parts of the app, including settings and links to help and feedback. This has been a general overview of the daily routine UI. More videos coming soon.